meet patient X, a 21-year-old male who is currently sexually active. Patient X visits his family doctor to inquire about preventative measures against contracting HIV. His doctor tells him about several different protective methods, one of which is a newly designed HIV-1 prevention pill. To learn more about this drug, patient X visits the Demystifying Medicine channel. HIV, also known as the human immunodeficiency virus, is a virus that targets the immune system, leaving room for infections to take place. Currently, there is no cure for HIV once an infection is established. However, HIV can be treated and managed to prevent the manifestation of AIDS, which eventually degrades the immune system to a point where any infection can be fatal. Since there is no cure for HIV, the best way of slowing down the AIDS epidemic is through prevention and awareness. One of the most promising strategies in preventing HIV-1 infections is pre-exposure prophylaxis, or PrEP. PrEP is an antiretroviral medication that targets the step in the HIV replication cycle where the virus transcribes its RNA into double-stranded DNA. PrEP should be taken as a preventative measure and is administered using oral pills or topical vaginal gel formulations. Before beginning to take PrEP, an HIV test needs to be done to ensure the patient has an HIV negative status as PrEP is not to be used in HIV positive individuals. PrEP can be used by anyone who is sexually active, regardless of the nature of their relationships, or if their partner has a confirmed HIV positive status. PrEP can also be used by individuals who frequently use needles to inject drugs or other substances and share needles frequently. PrEP can reduce the risk of contracting HIV-1 in at-risk individuals. However, it should not substitute for safe sex practices and injection procedures. To this date, there is only one PrEP medication that is currently approved in Canada and the United States, and it is sold under the brand name Trivada. Trivada is a combination of two drugs, imitricitabine and tenofovir disoproxyl fumarate, which are synthetic nucleosides. A nucleoside is a compound containing a nitrogenous base attached to a 5-carbon sugar, and it can be visualized as a nucleotide without the phosphate group. These drugs work by indirectly inhibiting an enzyme that is important for HIV replication called reverse transcriptase. When HIV infects the cell, reverse transcriptase works by copying the viral single-stranded RNA into double-stranded DNA. This DNA will invade the host genome and uses the cell's machinery to make copies of itself. Trivada works by interfering with reverse transcriptase's ability to synthesize the double-stranded DNA, thus stopping the virus from replicating and preventing infection. The majority of the studies that tested the efficacy of the drug found that it was consistently more effective than the placebo group. Baitian and Al conducted a study examining heterosexual couples and found that PrEP's effectiveness at reducing HIV-1 transmission was 44%, but also established that the effectiveness of the drug was correlated with proper use. They discovered that when individuals took the drug 90% of the time or more, the effectiveness increased to 73% and 92% when it was taken daily as prescribed. A study by Grant and Al was able to replicate the same results, showing again that PrEP can be very effective if used correctly. They concluded that when individuals took the drug four times a week, the drug's efficacy was 96% and 99% if they took the drug daily. These results have been observed in many other papers in a wide variety of study populations, such as heterosexual couples, homosexual men, and transgender women. To emphasize, if Trivada is taken daily as prescribed, it can be very effective in reducing the risk of contracting HIV-1. Trivada has been used since 2004 in other treatments, so its effects are well documented. When using Trivada for PrEP, it can have side effects including vomiting, diarrhea, headaches, and dizziness. The most common side effect of Trivada is nausea. However, this symptom has been observed to lessen over time. The more serious side effects include liver problems, kidney damage, and bone problems, although these effects were rarely observed in clinical trials. Overall, Trivada for PrEP has proven to be relatively safe and effective. There are multiple ways to reduce the risk of contracting HIV-1 apart from using PrEP, including the correct use of condoms, reducing the number of sex partners, and following proper injection procedures. Now that patient X has learned more about HIV PrEP, he should refer back to his family doctor to have an open discussion about whether Trivada is the right choice for him. For more interesting videos, 
please visit the Demystifying Medicine channel.